Last year, ST announced the STM32 MP2, the first STM32 to combine 64 bit Cortex A35 cores and Cortex M33. Today, we are thrilled to present the STM32 MP25, the first official member of the STM32 MP2 series and the most advanced MPU in our current roadmap. Thanks to its new graphics and video capabilities, the STM32 MP25 supports impactful US and Full HD videos at 60 frames per second. And thanks to its diverse display interfaces, developers can create larger and richer human machine interfaces. Additionally, it includes a neural processing unit or NPU capable of 1.35 tops for edge AI applications. And we are announcing today that you can already experience this power even before getting your hand on the physical device. Thanks to the STAI board farm, you can run a neural network on the STM32 MP25 in the cloud and experience what this new NPU can do. Then, once you get your hands on the STM32 MP25, you will see that it is our first STM32 supporting three Ethernet ports. One is directly connected to the Gigabit Media Access Control, or GMAC. The other two are connected to a switch cascaded behind a second GMAC. It means developers can drive new connected industrial applications by managing network packages without weakening the processors. And we can't wait for you to discover the other faster peripherals found in the STM32 MP25, like the PCI Express Gen2 controller, the USB 3 module, or the 3 kfd interfaces. With the STM32 MP25, you can see how ST's second-generation STM32 microprocessor enables secure and advanced edge AI computing and brings the robustness needed for industry 4.0 applications. ST is committed to releasing a lot more STM32 MP2 devices and doing it fast in the form of the STM32 MP2-3 and STM32 MP2-1 with pin-to-pin -pin compatibility for several packages across the STM32 MP2 series. It will bring a lot of flexibility as engineers reuse PCB layouts and code. The STM32 MP25 will be in mass production by the first half of this year. Well, the STM32 MP23 will arrive by the end of 2024. As for the STM32 MP21, we will also be sampling it by the end of 2024 with production expected in the first half of 2025. So stay tuned for more details throughout the year. And that's not all for the ST microprocessors. Let's go to Amit, who will tell us how it is now possible to run a real-time operating system on the STM32 MP13.